ain't gonna, I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna address that. I'm just gonna. Well, Pepe, he he said he, not he said gonna, he gonna pull up. Not even gonna address that. He said he wanna play one on one. I ain't gonna address we gonna that. We're gonna have to go ahead and throw some. some, some but I just want to know, like, what do I know? Like, what am I supposed to know? Not even gonna address that because if we played three times and both our stats are nasty, trash. We right? know he don't score. So then it ain't no conversation. So it's not really. I mean, so it's both net. Like he acting like he did something. He's a defensive player. He's just gonna try to shut you down. Oh, okay. Well, congratulations. What, what, did you have your? Excuse? <laughs> I think y'all should just play one on one. Get it over with. Anybody has a problem? You are Who, free to come on the pod. Huh? Hey, this nigga say he made somebody. What? Listen, he said he made you. I don't want to say it. Like yeah. y'all, y'all know how y'all. Do I ass, look bro. like? Do I look like I would ever tap to anybody less than me? That's why I got played less than me. We're gonna all be here just like, like less, this. like less than me, like less than me, like bro. <laughs> you're less. <laughs> you're I'm less just saying, than we all just we just want to watch. Less than me, man. I'm. You're my son. Your mom didn't tell you. You're my son. Can we all just get along? <laughs> you're my son, bro. I quit because you're my son. I don't want to do my son like that. <laughs> Gotta go home. So it's looking like Gilbert Arena's co-host Rashad McCants got into and heated altercation with the guest Patrick Beverly. I would like to show you guys what led up to that. Patrick Beverly has said this about Rashad McCants talking to Gilbert Arenas on his podcast. Let's check out the clip right here. Y'all did a take about the comment Carl Anthony Towns made. It was more special what we did in Minnesota. What we did was more special than we had what they month. did. This was last season when Pat Bev was on the team. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. The WNBA had bigger moments yeah. than that. Didn't he say some more shit after that? Yeah. Does it matter? Yeah. Did he? Say Does it matter? Shit? He already started. He said off. some no, more no, no, wild no. shit. Yeah. Did you guys actually watch the pod, or you guys watch clips of the pod? They just showed us the clips. So, okay, so that's why your answer was kind of uh, ignorant. Okay, probably, probably. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. so, the take was, it was the ignorant. Take, yeah, the how take, it the, because the, if you listen to the pod, the pod spoke about how we got together team wise, mm -hmm. not about the success we had on the basketball court. Like mm -hmm. that was the argument. Did Rashad McCants ever tell you his history with me? Nah, nah. Very interesting. I made him quit. <laughs> wait, wait, what? Yeah, we tried out for the Lakers early in my career, and it was just me and him in a workout. He quit it. Oh, man. so anything he says, I can't take anything. Okay, so Patrick Beverly was a guest on Gilbert Arena show, Gil's Arena. And this is what happened with Rashad McCants and Patrick Beverly. And before I highlight the clip, be sure to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you're new to the channel. Let's check out this clip. What's the We hooped. I finished the workout, you did. Okay, so you said you made me quit. I don't, I don't, I ain't never worked out with a person that didn't finish the You workout. said mm. you mm. made me mm. quit. That, 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 I, I told you, you. your podcast, you <laughs> said Rashad McCann's <laughs> no one, y'all don't know what he talking like, about. We want Hooper. We want you, 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 you said, we you want said, I'm talking about. He took like, but look, but look. Hey, Pat, see, this one was crazy. It's like, I don't even know Pat like that. Wait. To even like hear those words come out of his mouth. I never worked out with somebody and some and and, and we're working out to get, make an NBA team. We ain't working out for no motherfucking AAU team. Okay. We ain't working out for no mm. this Joe Blow fucking league. So we let are working me out get for to the, the Los facts. Angeles Lakers. Hey. I finished the workout. Coach Han was the motherfucking person running the workout. He came to me before the season started. Hey man, you remember that workout we had, man? You, Mr. Shea, you remember he quit? I forgot about it. Damn, I did make a motherfucking quit. This said was there was no story, Brandon. Thirteen years ago, Brandon. He said there was no story. So let me tell it. Okay, I mean, hey, he said he. It was Darv that said it. No, I said we I, doing. I just said I listen. Just quit. I just we said doing the jump test, all the little metric test before we that. do the workout. I don't want to hear that shit. <laughs> I don't want to hear that. That's that losing oh, no, mentality. That, hey, shit. Hey, I don't hey, hear that hey, shit. Hey, that shit don't go hey, at me, man. Yeah, so I'm, I'm ready jump, for I that. jump up. I'm ready for that. I jump I'm ready up. for that. Uh, I'm ready for that. Uh, I'm ready for this. Pat, can I tell the story? Ready. That is my <laughs> hey, look, you sweating ready. now. He look, ready. Gilbert did the shit the other day. He ain't ready. That's what happens when you when you don't know the side of the story. You start get the Relax. No, I just you triggered. No, I'm no not. you triggered. You, you been calm the whole time. You been right now. You been calm the whole time. You happen. The reason I was working out for the Lakers, we ain't time for a favor. It was a favor workout. My agent, Mitch Kupchak, gave me the UNC. Yo, we gonna bring you in. So when he didn't call me that day to go in for the workout, he said, "Shy, this is gonna be easy." I said, "Who I'm working out with?" He said, we don't know, some, somebody from overseas. Yeah, buddy. Yeah. So I said, what's his name? Buddy in the back with that knife. I said, what's yeah. his name? <laughs> Crazy mother. I said, what's his name? What's his but, name? Yeah. He said, Pat Beverly. Yeah. I said, Pat Beverly. You don't I, know. 
<laughs> you know, I don't know who that is. You know that? <laughs> but whoever it is, he, no. he's not in my way. Say less. He's not in my way. And then who happened? is he? Niggas know. Who? And what happened? Who is he? Oh, he a point guard. What? Why they got me working what out with a point though? guard? What, 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 what they got me working but, out with a point guard? So, 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 so I do the jump. I'm not going to front. I do the vert jump. that's working out for the NBA team, we not fucking around. Right. Like, like, what are like, you like, talking like, about? If I got a chance to work out for an NBA team, I'm not fucking around. So look. Like, I don't, I, like, I don't you, give a Look, fuck. they already promised me the spot. Oh. Okay. They promised me the spot. They promised me the spot. So after the workout was done and I said I couldn't go no more, Mitch met me at half court and said, Shad. What does that mean? I don't need you. I didn't need you anymore. Mitch, Mitch. Mitch said, I, I did not, I got drafted by the Lakers. Brandon, right you see he not letting me, he let, he not let, he's still oh, getting the explaining. He's still, no, no, he still getting the explaining. He's still getting the explaining. So go ahead, listen, go ahead, go ahead, go listen, my nigga. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. So if Mitch telling me, listen, Shaw, you haven't played in a year. We need to see, we need to see some footage, bro. Go overseas, get some footage, we got you. This is Mitch UNC Connect, half court. I say, Mitch, man, I can't go no more. He said, don't even worry. We didn't bring you in here to go. What Look the who fuck we... does that have to do with We me? didn't bring you in to go because I didn't quit, <laughs> nigga. I already had the spot. You was the motherfucker that was just in there, nigga. So why you... You was just in there. That, 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 that we're not talking about the people that's supposed to be... I wanted that, right? to kill you, my nigga. I didn't... Wanted... I'm like, yo, I you're a point guard. You don't got a chance. Million you didn't have a chance. But I did. You're a point guard. Okay. You didn't have a... Chance you, in the world, nigga. You, you still don't got a chance in the world, that's nigga. You would right. never have a chance. <laughs> My did. name matched that's up to right. yours in any right. capacity. Yeah, in any man. capacity, yeah. you don't got a chance, yeah. Yeah. nigga. We have a shadow. You gotta prove court. yourself against we me, nigga. I don't gotta prove. Okay. I didn't have to prove wait, myself wait, against Beverly. Hold on, hold on. I look like you now. I don't have to now, nigga. You did. Because I will you now. I will you now. Wait, no, but I'm just saying. No, 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 no. Be a real nigga. Ask him. Can't, if you can't go no him. more. Ask him. I had a second degree ankle sprain, my nigga. Oh, I'm done. Okay. I'm done. Y'all can't be no real. Now you done? Now you done? Now you done? So that was you, said, Dar you said Darvin told you. You said, oh, Darvin told me you quit. Oh, Darvin told me. I didn't say nothing. I didn't say nothing. So Darvin yeah. told me. Now all of a sudden, you, Yo. oh, oh, don't talk to yeah. me. So oh, the, so the ankle is. Twist his angle? I don't know. I don't know. He don't so know. Now he don't know. No, I'm trying to figure out. So he don't he know. He angle? said he made me I quit. Did. Ask him what he was doing to make me quit. Beating you in the workout. Beating me in a shoot. Yeah. We're shooting jumpers. We were playing one on one. No, we won. We did one up and down. That's so, why so I couldn't go. Which one? We did one, one up and down. down. His story is We did one up and down. Any hooper no. We did one. Any hooper no. If you're playing and trying out for an NBA team. I'm not trying out. You trying out, nigga. You trying out. And that's why you got to give 130%, like, like, no, nigga. You, you he promised me the no, spot. 200. You in there. No, no. You in there not, just to fucking be there, yeah, nigga. But, but not one You're not there to do anything but else. I'll just have another nigga no, in there no, with no, me. No. But no. But, but, what but, you talking about? The problem is, the, but look, I know y'all niggas strong, is teaming yeah. up. No. Y'all should high five each other. No, no, no. High five each other. Y'all niggas is crazy. Y'all niggas, hey. And Ask down. the chat if it's obvious. Just say, down. is it Only obvious? Only just the playoff ballot. I said, okay. I don't know. I didn't quit. So, I didn't quit because so, Pat Beverly was out there. Oh, nigga. so you quit because you was hurt? Yes, nigga. Okay, all right, then. I, my, my, my ability. I played the game, so I can't go physical off with the, ability. Your ability, I got, if you ain't got an ability to make nobody quit. That's what it is. Uh -huh. So I can't go off. Ain't no I can't, ability. I can't. What you mean? Is, is it obvious? What the what fuck is y'all talking no, about? I mean, is it obvious? I, 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 I didn't cap. I didn't cap. Is it obvious? Or is it obvious? No, no, it's no beef. No, I didn't cap. No, I just wanted to the truth. Let me bring it in. Let me bring it in. Is it obvious? Let me bring it in. Yes or no? Yes or no? Is it obvious? And recently, Mashad McCants had got into it with Miko. She's the female guest that comes on the show quite often and the best way i can explain how rashad mccants is on that show he reminds me of ryan hollands from espn ryan hollands will have some of these wild takes and say some of the craziest things man so if you look at the feedback everybody kind of just be cooking rashad mccants in the comment section i would like for you guys to get in the comment section down below how do y'all feel about how everything played out how do y'all feel about rashad mccants on gills arena salute so to gills arenas man they just finished up season one can't wait till they come back Hit the like button for me if you made it this far in the video. Don't forget to subscribe up as well. And I'll catch you guys on the next video. And we out, guys. Peace.